मैं दीवान पे चढ़ के मैं इधर से ले जैसे घुमाते हुए ही लोग बैठे हुए हैं ना फाउंटेन भी ले लीजिएगा You knew, Emperor Shah Jahan, that the stream of time washes over life, over youth and riches. Only your heart's pain you had hoped would remain immortal. The harsh thunder of imperial power will fade into the twilight. Let it. Only let one deep sigh fill the heart of the vast sky with longing. This was your wish. Let all the glitter of emeralds, pearls, rubies and diamonds disappear like a fading rainbow. But let this one solitary tear pearl remain glistening on the cheek of time, this white splendid Taj Mahal. And again during the night you rejuvenate the garden with dewdrops, with new blossoms and buds to arrange the flower basket of autumn in a tear-touched farewell smile. Dear heart, your gatherings at the end of the day, at the end of the night and at the end of the road, you have to leave behind. For there is no time to recount, there is no time to remember. Emperor, is that why your frightened heart wanted to conquer the heart of time? Is that money? <laughs> Traveller's checks would be acceptable. Those endearments that you whispered softly to your beloved, those whispered intimacies you have left behind here for eternity's sake. The sad tenderness of your love finds expression here amidst this beauty and this bouquet captured in serene stone. Emperor Poet, this is the portrait of me in meter, in music. It stretches upwards towards the ethereal where your beloved longs for you and waits. Blended in the soft hue of dawn and blended into the tired evenings, 
sad breath, blended with the seductive grace of this full moonlight beyond the shores of language where the homeless, despairing eyes roam from door to door, searching. But I have not forgotten you. Emperor, no kingdom could ever hold you. The ocean-breasted world could not quench the thirst of your greatness, and hence, at the end of this festival of life, you discard this world like a used clay pot. My Mumtaz, ladies and gentlemen. Feeling good now. <laughs> this will be the first time in the history of India that gentlemen and others are going to be invited into the Zanana. Tonight, I would like my brother Mark to lead you all. Mark turned 60 last week, and we're now going to let Shah Jahan pass his Mumtaz Jen back to her husband. Mark, would you come forward to the Zanana? You can still say no. <laughs> Thank you. 